Hey guys, what's up? I am Poppy Padilla. If you've seen a few of my videos and you keep coming back for more, you should consider subscribing and hitting the notifications tab. All right, back to business, boys. Today is part two of the Prestige Cup, and we're going to be using this BMW i8. I'm going to have a few fun facts about this car, but uh, let's go get started. For those of you that are tuning in for the first time, every two weeks we do the Prestige Cup just because we need those RP points. Uh, if you get in a crew that's a good crew, they're going to require that you get um, the minimum. You, you got to get a minimum every single season. You know, sometimes it's higher, sometimes it's lower. Um, and that's the reason being, because at the end of the Prestige Cup, you get over, you can get almost, what, 300,000, I think, if you count it all up. But the last race, you get 180K, 180,000 RP points. And that's a really big boost, especially if you're, you know, trying to make your minimums. I already made my minimum for the season, but this is going to help out, you know, it's going to help out my team. I've been in crews where the minimum was around 500, 500,000. So as you get better, if you're new to the game, you know, that might be hard for you to do if you don't have all the cars or the keys and all that other stuff. But um, just stick to it, man. You, you're definitely going to uh, get better at the game. Uh, it's just a, a patience thing with this game. You know, it takes a while to, to rack up all these fusion parts. I'm not sure if I said this part in the previous one, in part one. See, look, there's 30,000 right there. That's a big chunk, man. And they get even bigger as you progress in the, in the Prestige Cup. But what I was going to say is, uh, I think it was 1972 when BMW came out with an electric car. So this is a hybrid car, this, this BMW i8. It's a hybrid. So that means with it being hybrid, it's part gasoline and part electric. But they built the first, their first electric car in 1972. And uh, even though this is a hybrid, uh, I don't think their fully uh, functional electrical cars are gonna be faster than a Tesla or anything like that. But, um, you know, I like this car. I just wish it was a little bit faster. And BMW is basically, if you translate it, it's like Bavarian Motor Corp or something like that. Um, I don't know. I don't speak the language, but I know that they shortened it to BMW. But they used to they used to make airplanes before they made cars. So in the logo, the hold on. But the actual logo is blue and white, right? So what they did is they took parts of the Bavarian flag, put it into the logo, and that's how they got the logo. Now, some say that it's a spinning propeller. I think it's a spinning propeller. And they happened to put in the two, uh, you know, the two colors from the flag. I think it's part flag, and I also think it's a spinning propeller. I don't know, what, what you think, boys? You know, some people like, nah, 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 no, no, no. It's just supposed to represent part of the flag because they're from, you know, it's a Bavarian company flag. But I don't know, man. It's, it's basically... I think it's a, a spinning propeller. I mean, I think that they're pretty proud that they used to make planes and successful planes. So I don't know, man.
<laughs> Successful planes. What I meant to say is reliable planes. They made really good planes back then, and I, it just makes sense that that would be a spinning propeller. On top of that, they were able to use the Bavarian flag, the Bavarian colors. That's why there's hints in blue of, you know, all over the car and all, most of their cars, you know, it's pretty cool. We're just moving right along, fellas. Yes, sir. Speaking of hints of blue, look at the grill. The grill on the BMWs is what they call a kidney grill. And that's what makes most of these BMWs recognizable. Dude, I, and I like that. I like that type. I mean, it's it's a it's a style of branding, right? It's it's like if the car is from afar, and you see the kidney grill, you know it's a BMW, and that's what I like about that. To where is, uh, like, look, there's a kidney grill on that one too, and that's a, another BMW that we're racing. So you can kind of spot them out, even in your garages, if you have a lot of BMWs. But I love that kidney grill and the fact that you can recognize a BMW from afar just by looking at the grill. I think they have a full patent on that kidney grill. So only BMWs can be used, you know, can use that type of grill. I think it's awesome. It fits it. We're almost done, right? You. Yeah, we only got one more. This is good. This is good. Time flies when you're having fun. Look at all the keys and the resources and the gold and everything else. We are just having a good time today, my friends. <laughs> Ooh. Send a carbon theme by MSO, the McLaren. Okay. I actually have that car. I didn't do much to it. But here we go. Yeah, boy. Look, 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 look. So here we go. I want to tell you. This is the reason why I do this. That right there. 180,000 RP points. Like I said before, I already met my minimum. But, dude, that's going to put me over a mil. And uh, mad props for every... I mean, because I have people that, that comment that they can throw up two mil, three mil, four mil a season mad props to you if you can do that i think i'd burn myself out if i did that but uh that is part two of the prestige cup boys uh, i hope you enjoyed it and just so that you know a refresher every two weeks i give you a season update of what the prestige cup car is going to be we take a test ride in the in the prize car that we typically get i tell you what the prize car for that season's going to be and then the following day we have a rare crate opening if we don't have the car i actually think i have next season's prize i mean not prize car but the uh the prestige cup it's that red car right there that lotus so i believe that red car is going to be the next season prestige cup car i could be wrong i've been wrong in the past but uh you know be looking for that update because that's what we're going to do Every two weeks, we do that for every season and every Prestige Cup and every Rare Crate opening. But anyway, uh, if there's anything about this video that you like, feel free to smash that like button and you should consider subscribing, especially if you like the content and you keep coming back for more. I appreciate all the subscribers. I appreciate you watching and I'll catch you in the next video.